Hey everyone, Janie here. Welcome back. I am obviously not at my garden, but I am in one of my most favorite places and that is Wintour Gardens up in Redding, California. It is one of my favorite nurseries and this is one of my favorite people, Ellen. She is the manager here. She runs everything. She's the boss lady. Yeah. <laughs> so hey here at Wintour Gardens, it's really, really exciting because they are actually selling proven winners. They have proven winners shrubs, Proven Winners Perennials and Proven Winners Annuals this year. Yeah, you guys heard me, Proven Winners Annuals this year. I'm gonna show you guys, they are growing everything. You have plugs coming in next week, yep. even more. Oh, it's very exciting. So if you guys live anywhere near Redding, California, you guys should make a trip here. It is, it's gorgeous here. It is so beautiful. Empty your cars before you go. <laughs> <laughs> and the big announcement that we wanted to make, right? Yeah. So on May, 13th, we are joining forces and we are going to do a Proven Winners event here. So I'm gonna come and I'm gonna talk and I'm gonna share my knowledge of Proven Winners, show you guys a couple fun things, do a couple maybe containers, there might be some giveaways. Yes, very exciting. So that would be May 13th at- 11 o'clock. 11 o'clock and I will link Winter Gardens in the, in the description down below. It is so busy here today. The line is out the door. There are so many people here, everyone getting ready to garden. So I'm gonna let Ellen go. I'm gonna go show you guys a little bit behind the scenes of where they grow everything. Okay, hopefully the wind doesn't make it too hard for me to hear. I didn't bring my microphone, but as far as the eyes can see, you can see plants are growing all the way down here. Plus greenhouses as well. Okay, so here are all the baby plants that have been growing, just lines and rows, tons and tons of them. And they sell a whole bunch of different stuff, including Proven Winners. But of course, I had to show you guys Proven Winners because Proven Winners is what I'm gonna be talking about. Here is some of the Rock and Fuchsia. Rock and Fuchsia, I actually have this in my garden. It has lasted for, it's going on, it's fourth year now, I have to say, and it is amazing. The hummingbirds absolutely love it. Looks like they have a couple of the Whirlwind Blue. This is one that I've actually put in my cottage garden this year. I am super excited about it because it is so heat tolerant. It can handle the heat. Other people that have grown it, if you look at the reviews on the Proven Winners website, they've talked about how this is the plant that lasts for them all season long, even throughout the heat. Here in Redding, California, they get extremely hot here during the summers, just like we do in Davis. So that is a good one. I wish they had more of them though. Oh, it looks like there's more back there. And then coming over here, you can see even more Proven Winners. I think these are the Superbinas is what Ellen told me. I did get permission to show you guys all this. So another one of my favorite, Superbina Sparkling Amethyst. So beautiful. They also have Superbina Sparkling Rosé that I have grown, but I put it in too much shade. It needed more sun. So it didn't do as well as, for me as the Superbina Sparkling Amethyst that I just, I was obsessed with. They have Peachy King. They have Superbina Imperial Blue, which is, I actually haven't tried this one before, but it's supposed to be incredible, amazing and they have tons of them here at Wintour Gardens. All right, then this not for sale sign right here. Ellen just showed me this. I think they're saving these for May 13th. Don't quote me on that, but I know they're saving these, plus they're getting um, another whole bunch of plugs in that they're gonna be growing for May 13th as well. But these are their Super Tunias. So they have a whole bunch of Super Tunia Vista Jazzberry, which I'm so excited about. Super Tunia, Super Tunia Royal Velvet beautiful supertunia limoncello you guys this is the one that was in my lemonade stand recipe last year that i loved so very much mix it with a yellow lantana oh it's just perfect supertunia vista paradise so good supertunia picasso in purple i don't see any supertunia vista bubblegum i'm sure i'm just missing it Oh, I spoke too soon. Lots and lots and lots of Supertunia Vista bubblegum. You guys, if you're looking for plants, you're looking to buy them in store, 
come here if you're close. <laughs> I live two hours away and I would still come here. More bubblegum, more jazzberry, more royal magenta. All right, let's go see what else. I see more Proven Winners cans over there, so let's see what else I can find. All right, we've got Super Bells here. Have you guys ever grown Super Bells Dreamsicle? I have never grown this one, but how cool. I cannot wait to see once this one starts blooming here. And then coming over here, just more and more rows of Proven Winners annuals. So exciting, you guys. I cannot wait. Oh, Ellen took me over to show me a couple more. Look at all these guys. Ipamia, oh, Bacopa, yay. There we go. So pretty. You guys have so much stuff. You have so yeah, much and you have more coming in. More. That's incredible. This is exciting. All right, you guys, get your wallets out. That's what I say. <laughs> People call and ask, what do I need to bring? I say, your checkbook. Just bring a checkbook and an empty card. Yeah. That's, that's yeah. what I always forget. <laughs> okay, and then coming over here to this section, it's so beautiful here. And the last time, the last year I was here, one of these birds, oh look, can you guys see that? These birds make nests for themselves here. And then what they'll do is that they will dive bomb the customers here to protect the nests. Look at them. Can you see it? You see the daddy? Mommy or daddy, I don't know. So I've been coming here with my parents for about four years now and almost every single year I can remember those birds have been making their nests here and protecting it <laughs> like no other they literally you will walk through here at certain times of the year and they will come and they will dive bomb you so you have to you have to walk through i take my purse and i put it over my head and i run <laughs> so i don't even really want to show you guys this because i feel like these are going to be sold out before you have a chance to get here but who knows right you never know they always have a handful of limelight standards. They're so beautiful. I actually purchased one of these for my mom last year. It is gorgeous. It is so pretty. And look at this one. This one's already starting to come out, starting to come out of dormancy at this point. I wanted to show you over here. They have more of their hydrangeas. They have less, let's dance big band, let's dance rave. But look what I found. Oh, I am so tempted to buy this right now. Can you guys see that? This is their new one, Pufferfish. I want it so bad, but I'm going on an airplane in a couple hours, so I obviously can't get it. I hope it's still here once I get back. Also, they have Bobos. I love Bobos. This is Panicle. This is Panicle. Panicle hydrangeas will always do better in hotter environments. So if you guys have a hard time uh, with hydrangeas because you get too hot, try a Panicle like Limelight, Limelight Prime, Bobo, pufferfish, there's so many and they're so beautiful. Quick fire standards. Oh, man, you guys, I am tempted to just make a pile and get it when I come home. Oh my goodness, they got a lot of stuff in this year. How fun. All right, so hopefully you guys can see me okay. It is so bright today here. And of course there's no tree cover, which is great for the plants. The plants are gonna grow beautifully out here in the sun. But I just wanted to give you all a sneak peek, especially since I was up here visiting my mom. It's actually my mom's birthday today. And um, you guys can probably hear there's an airport across the way and my mom and I are headed off on a little trip. I will keep you guys updated on where we're going. It's so, oh, I'm just so excited. I think probably the video tomorrow it will be enough time that I will have had time to edit and post what we're actually doing. So anyway, there is a ton of really, really cool varieties, not just Proven Winners, of course, there's tons of other stuff. Um, but of course, you know, I work with Proven Winners and so I want to emphasize that. Plus, it's so hard it's so hard to find Proven Winners annuals, at least here in California. So whenever there's a place that has Proven Winners, I always want to tell you guys about it because it's obviously always better to be able to come and pick out the plants yourself rather than from buying them online. Of course, you can always buy Proven Winners from provenwinners.com. They come. My mom just bought a big shipment for her birthday. She's super excited. I'm going to help her plant it. Um, but 
coming to the garden center it like you just you, you can't beat that it's just such a fun experience so anyway may 13th i'm a little nervous i'm a little nervous to be talking in front of everybody but i think it should be fine it's all the stuff that i know you know and i can talk about in my sleep you know heat tolerant varieties here in reading it's a little bit harsher weather like a little bit colder they, they actually got snow this winter that they, they got a couple snowstorms and then it, it's a little bit colder in the winter and a little bit hotter in the summer so the plants that they grow here have to be able to handle that and they do a really really good job and i love the selection that they've picked out of the proven winners annuals so anyway just wanted to give you guys a sneak peek of what's been going on may 13th at 11 a.m i will put all the details below and that is yes that is one week after my garden tour so i am a busy girl <laughs> so i hope you guys enjoyed this let me know if you have any questions i am going to get a plant list of what they have available so you know i might be able to give you guys a little sneak peek about what they have if you have questions for me about that um yeah i hope you enjoyed this and i hope you have a chance to get in your garden today